Tschüss Leute, wir sind hier in Oberhausen bei Bad Out of Hell und wie ihr im letzten Video gesehen hattet, haben wir coole Interviews mit den drei Boys gemacht, die Stretch spielen, aber das war nicht alles. Wir haben nämlich natürlich äh, uns noch ein paar lustige Games ausgedacht, die wir richtig so YouTube-mäßig mit denen <lacht> gespielt haben und das war mega lustig. Ja, das war einfach so cool. Gönnt euch Leute, los geht's! Now we play! Okay. Yeah! Games! <lacht> so, on his channel, uh, on his YouTube channel, we uh, have a game, it's Rip It or Ship It, where you have like two characters and you have to say like, uh, do you ship them together? Be like, oh yeah, they're like a good match for each other, I really love them together, or you'd be like, no, that won't work, I don't see that at all. Mm. Okay. As okay. if they would be in a relationship. Yes. Yeah. You yes. remove Raven. <laughs> okay. She doesn't exist now. She doesn't exist. So Strat is free. <laughs> what we have uh, chosen uh, is based on some fan theory stuff, which is going on in Ooh. like a fan groups Ooh. of Bad Out of Hell. Nice. So, in an early version of the Manchester uh, run, yeah. there was two out of three ain't bad, mm -hmm. and Zahara is singing about this one boy she was in love with, and you see Strad walking over the stage in the background. So, rip it or ship it, Zahara and Strad. We can start here. <laughs> Do we have to explain it or just say it? Shall we just say yeah. what we think and yeah. then maybe can first, we explain first, it? Again? Yeah, yeah. First. Ship it. Ship. Ship it? Yes. Ship yes. it. Why not? She's <laughs> beautiful. <laughs> Ship it. Okay, now explain, like shortly. I think Zahara and Stripe would be a good match if she wouldn't think so much. So that's why in the first thing I would say ship it, but I, th I don't think the relationship would last long. At first sight, ship it, but if she's gonna talk a thing too much. You know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just feel bad now because I feel like if it was in the original, it's because it, it is actually a thing. For me, it is not. <laughs> yeah. The, the way I play it, it has nothing to do with that. I, I mean, they, they cut it out, right? So yeah. for yeah. a reason. For, <laughs> like, they're both so powerful that I don't think that would be a thing. Like, they wouldn't feel attractive. I think it happened, something between them. But then, as uh, our nice Robin said, uh, he thinks too much, and maybe the, after two or three times that uh, they were dating and slept together, he realized that uh, really she really do doesn't get his point. So you said you wanted to attract more gay people. People to come to the show. Don't get me wrong. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not saying I'm mean to the show. So, sorry, <laughs> I put this out wrong. <laughs> No, come. <laughs> Poor his boyfriend. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry. Um, well, let's talk about Strat and Pink then. Yeah. Rip or ship? Yes. Yes. Ship. Ship. Okay, okay, let's start with so you. Then my ship. There's something between them. You can you can feel it. You can taste it during uh, during the whole show. But I think that uh, uh, maybe Strat was playing a lot with him. He likes Tink. But maybe he's not so brave to, to get further in their yeah. relationship. But he really wants to stay with him. He really wants to spend time with him. And he's also, he cut us him. So mm. it means something. Do you it's, think they ever hooked up? No. Because there's so much time, they spend so much time together. They, they could have. I mean. No, I think because uh, how things react is, is kind of, uh, you are playing with me. It's always like, uh, you are promised me something, so we are, we are always on the edge to be more than friends. So it's always this fine line, but they never get further mm. from that. Uh, for me, no. Uh, what we say when Tank died is like, you're my soulmate. You're my Spoiler <laughs> alert! <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, I'm very sorry for that. At some point in the show, he will say, <laughs> You're my brother, you're my soulmate. So, um, yeah, I just see it as that like yes. you would thing. say this also to your man or, or I would say this also to my girl no no, no. not my brother yeah a few like soulmate and brother are two different words right yeah I get if but you put them together both. yeah 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 and I just think he protects him because hmm. at the beginning I thought that Tink kind of got frozen about when he was 16 but yeah. then I was told that it was like kind of 14 or 15 yeah. oh, okay the way I see it is because it's this dystopian future and like the rules that apply right now wouldn't really apply. So I think probably the whole Lost Gang, just at some point, they all hooked up with each other. Yeah. Boys with girls and girls with horses and whatever. <laughs> <laughs> and, oh, that's so interesting. <laughs> they maybe had something, but just, just for fun, like yeah. no, yeah. nothing else. That's the way I see it, mm -hmm. my interpretation. Yeah, I really think that Strat just sees Tink as his little brother. Mm -hmm. yeah. And although the rules would change and would not apply, like in Obsidian as they would apply now, I think it would be, I think it wouldn't be something that Strat would do to hook up with 
like his little brother, because he's taking care of him, because we don't have parents. But when Tink kisses Strat, Strat's like, okay, I think he feels something different than I do, maybe I'm sending mixed signals, and then eventually, you know, trying to get just a friendship yeah. going again. And that's, that's what the difference is to me. Yeah. So that's why I would say rip it. Yeah, okay. Fan theory time again! Oh, here we go. <laughs> when they were young, but fro uh, frozen then. And Falco and Sloane just like <laughs> got, got, older. got older. And that's the frustration with Falco and Strat that uh, he actually still is that what Falco wants to be. And Sloane is still in Strat, and they were a thing back then. So what is. What is that? It could be Strats though. And she's like, of course I know who Strat is. Yeah. And so, yeah, there's, there's this. Theory out there, Strat and, and Sloan, rip it or ship it. And Wilhelmine, yesterday we told her that and she was like, ooh, I'm gonna take this into the show tonight. <laughs> if we would apply that fan theory, mm -hmm. I think it could be a ship it. Okay. Ship it. <laughs> Definitely. Ship it. Oh my god, what? Yeah, but, and, yeah. and the reason why I would ship it is because she is one of those people, if you, if you see Paradise and how she's acting, because they are in, in Paradise, for the people who don't know, they are pretending to be their 17 or 18 year old selves again. And they are going crazy. And the craziness about Sloan in that song is the craziness about her, how she was at, when she was at 17. That's what Strad loves. Yeah. That's why he loves Raven, because <laughs> mm -hmm. she's like, she's just one-on-one -on -one with her mother, but like the 17 or 18 year old version yeah, of true. Sloan. I just got that from the beginning. Like when I first arrived in London and I saw the bedroom team mm -hmm. with uh, Sloan and uh, Raven, just what you just said, when she says, oh, I, I know, I know his name. Mm -hmm. Like I've been there, girl, and and that's the reason. <laughs> I've been there, girl, <laughs> and that's the reason I think she is so like. No, but be careful. I've been there. I know how much you can suffer. Mm -hmm. She could also be jealous when she says, "Keep away from him." Yeah, maybe like, it's not. But in the end, she's like at the wedding, and she's like, "It's fine," and she hugs him. And, but and she loves Raven. When I did my Instagram takeover on our uh, at that does musical on Instagram, um, <laughs> <laughs> cheap plug. Uh, when I did the takeover, I got really seriously got a question: Do Strat and Sloan kiss? I really th thought like, would they have kissed at some point? And then I talked to the man about it, and she was like, "Oh yeah, I, I, I actually think they would have like way back when, because she was also young." Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's why I really like this fan theory mm -hmm. because it makes a lot, a lot of sense actually. Uh, how much time do we have? Do we have to stop? Can we cancel the rehearsal? <laughs> this is more fun. This is so much more fun. This is for us, and uh, I hope it's gonna be fun for you. So the last song is "I Would Do Anything for Love." Yes. And now we want to ask you what you would do for love. Ooh, like, right? actually do for love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> would you oh, pay a girl and go out with her, even though you knew she wasn't interested in you, but just to spend time with her and win her over? No. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, like, okay, like, I'm going. Like, like, if she's a girl, like, 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 I mean, you, at this point, you would be really, really desperate. Well, it's prostitution. <laughs> well, it doesn't have to be physical. <laughs> but would you do that? Would you go there for love? That's the question. I would no, I wouldn't go love. there. Yeah. Actually, we already do this, because when you go out for a date, you have to pay the dinner, <laughs> to, buy, to buy a You pizza. always would know how to twist something. It's yeah, so to like pick this. up with the car, so we have to clean the car, and so it's, it costs a lot, actually. So I have to spend more than this. You're the worst! <laughs> He's the best. <laughs> yeah. so you would do that, you won't do nah. that, you won't do that. I won't do that. No. I'm gonna say Raven. There is a bit of lion, I won't do anything. <laughs> This is a bit more extreme now. Yes, yeah. we like. Bring it on. Even the extreme. Uh, I, I, I wear sunglasses. You just, you just, you like, shut your ears. Oh. I use extreme, so I wear sunglasses. <laughs> if the only chance to find your true love was to wait until you're 50 and you weren't allowed to screw nor date any girl at all or boy, would you do that? You have so. a guarantee that at 50 you will meet your dream girl, dream boy, but. Beforehand, you're not allowed there's to do no anything with anyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's no other chance to find your love in another way. No, I won't do that. <laughs> I think you have to enjoy life to the fullest, because you never know how long you can. I wouldn't be able to do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! I mean, that's the right answer! <laughs> even if I put to me a goal, but I can't screw up after two weeks. <laughs> also, that's what happens with your New Year's resolutions. <laughs> ah, okay. I just leave a lot in. I think we all do, otherwise yeah. we wouldn't be here. Yes. Theater. <laughs> no, I think we... No. 
No. No. Because you, you know, you, you never know what's gonna happen tomorrow. Yes. You, you don't know if you're gonna be here tomorrow. It would have been the only chance, so it also means that in return, you're gonna have good hook hookups, but it's never gonna last. You're never gonna be like super in love. Like, you're fish that you're never gonna last. <laughs> 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 All right. No worries. So the last game is the lip reading game. Oh, so God. I'm wearing uh, noise cancellation <laughs> headphone things, and the other is like uh, telling you strat lines, and you have to like German read them strat lines. Yeah, yeah. Or, or I mean, you you, you English, must right? know them by heart, right? Oh yeah, so. yeah. <laughs> we sleep it every night. Oh gosh. All right. Okay. Who's gonna start? Uh, okay. What do we want to do? Do you have one? Yeah. Okay. okay you say first. Das kann nichts daran ändern. Ich liebe dich. It's a song, but I don't know. Das kann nichts daran ändern. Ich liebe dich. What? what? <laughs> das kann nichts daran ändern. Ich liebe dich. There's a lot of T's in there. <laughs> uh, I do the whole scene. Oh my Raven, gosh. was redest du denn da? Ah, uh, was? Uh, Raven, was redest du denn da? Yeah. Wow! Yeah, that one, yeah, but the other one, you were wrong. <laughs> Yeah, he actually did the uh, the the, uh, the sentence after that, but I think that was too hard. It was like, what was it? You're up. I'm gonna hear it with that. Siehst du die Sterne da oben? Weißt du, warum sie leuchten? Warum sie so strahlen? Warum sie überhaupt sehen können? Not too much. He knows the text. Come on, guys. But this is really, it's really... so stupid. <laughs> no, no. What's my picture? I felt, I felt it's super no, no. It's it's difficult, man. It's, it's, it's so hard. Man. It is so hard. Siehst du die Sterne da oben? This confused us to both. Yeah, almost. <laughs> okay. Siehst du die Sterne da oben? Weißt du, First act or second act? <laughs> First act, okay. <laughs> Yeah, talk to the last. Raven? Okay, it doesn't start with Raven. No. It's the only sentence. Siehst du die Sterne da oben, Raven? Nochmal. I don't know how he sounds deaf. Siehst du die Sterne da oben? Du? Ja, ja, ja. Siehst du die Sterne? Siehst du die Sterne da oben, Raven? Du. Ja. Es ist gerade zwei und die Hitze steigt und steigt immer mehr. <lacht> Geil. There's a Mia at the end. Ja, 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 ja. Again. <lacht> es ist gerade zwei und die Hitze steigt und steigt immer mehr. I just got the Mia again. <lacht> I really don't know what it is. Maybe you can try and work. I felt more. like at some point you say the glutes, but that's not that mm -hmm. you no. didn't say that at all, so it's not the same line. First act. Yeah, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> this one is so difficult. This is yeah. super, super difficult stuff. This is a song, right? Yeah. Yes, it is a song. <laughs> um, I have no idea. No? I feel like I'm losing at this. <laughs> oh come on, what what word by word? Yeah. S is Gerade zwei Got it? Yeah. und die Hitze steigt und steigt immer mehr. Yeah, it's not Mia, it's Mia. Yeah. Yeah. That's the one. Because <laughs> I was thinking a uh, phrase with Mia. Yeah. Ah. Uh, it's, it's gerade zwei. Yeah. 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 Whoa, that's it's difficult, right? It is. It is well really done. difficult. Well done. Well done. That. That's yeah, it, that's basically. It. Awesome. Thank you. Thank it was you so, so much. much fun. Thank you. Super, super Thank you guys cool. so much. It was really, really cool. It's gonna be a great video. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I think we're gonna jack your game because I think I think we're gonna do this with the cast at some point. <laughs> nice. <laughs> He's not gonna. I'm still uh, <laughs> nervous. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like some parts you're gonna have to cut. Yeah, yeah we yeah. for all audiences. But this yeah, is yeah, so special case. Oh no, people love juicy. That's it. So if you want to, or do you guys want yeah. to do that? Like invite the people to the show. To oh yeah, sure. Show? Yeah, uh, we are gonna be here for a little while longer in the Metronom Theater in Oberhausen. So please, bitte, komm vorbei und wir sehen uns dann vielleicht später hier in uh, im Metronom Theater bei Better to Hell das Musical. Yeah. 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 <laughs>